welcome back to my channel. Um, I have another Sensi haul. This is my first haul with our new spring and summer catalog. I'm like looking around. Um, I thought I had that catalog with me, but definitely I'll grab it. Um, I'm in my work office. So this is my, I work from home with my full-time job, but um, I have also turned this into my Sensi uh, videos with you guys. And YouTube videos if I'm making like a, like a haul with you guys or something um, that's you know facing you. But anyways, how are you? Okay, excuse the mess, but I'm doing my spring cleaning after this video with two hours of sleep. And you know why? Because I have been watching Heart of Dixie again. Okay, I've watched it like twice before the whole series. But for some reason after work, because I work the, the night shift or the late shift, then um, it's my relaxed time, everybody's sleeping, so I tend to watch, um, like, uh, I binge out on shows. I was watching, I think, Below Zero, Life in Alaska. I'm still with that one, but I wanted to take a break. I do have a huge Sensi, not huge, my first order. My first order with the Spring and Summer Catalog. As you guys know, Spring and Summer Catalog was released the 1st of March. We are now, I think, second week of March or almost second week. I Today is Wednesday. I'm off for four days. So I'm, I'm going to be making videos with you guys. I'm also going to be cleaning up my girls' room. We have a once a year uh, trash pickup. So this is the time that I go through all around the house and just kind of declutter and just get rid of stuff. I don't do the garage sales because we live in a hill and people don't stop. <laughs> people don't go stop at um, garage sales where we live and then um, trick-or-treating. I never get trick-or-treaters. Every year maybe I get one or two, or two kids and I'm like, why bother, right? Okay. Anywho, I'm going to bring up all my stuff in here. As always, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just had lunch. How are you, friends? I'm sorry I am bending down, but I was so excited. I opened up the box yesterday. It, the UPS guy came right before I started work, and I did not, did not have time to just go through the boxes. But I did smell, I did smell the new bars, okay? So excuse me while I go <laughs> grab the rest of the stuff, and then I'll come back and chit-chat with you guys. All right, I'm just gonna leave that box right next to me so that when I'm going through, um, I, my office is very small. This is the sauna room. That's the sauna over there, but I have used it as a storage for um, my Sensi stuff. So I purchased the new bulbs, the new colored bulbs, and I don't know if I got one of each or I got multiples of. When I do my orders, it's like in the middle of the night, so sometimes it's not really working to my advantage because I'm half awake or half asleep, kind of trying to purchase them. My first one with you guys is going to be the Country Living. I said this is going to be one of my first purchase, and it is. I actually ordered another one last night. I was kind of, I was kind of debating on which one was going to be my second order, but I could not resist on the the Dachshund warmer because we have a Chewini. So that one's in my um, next order. I just placed that last night. And then also um, the little weave, uh, weave basket. I think it's called Sweetgrass. <sighs> Couldn't resist that one, okay. So this one is called Country Living. And again, I think they just started um, out with a, with a warning. This product may contain sharp edges. This is going to be a bulb, I believe. 20 watt yeah a 20 watt uh, light bulb and I always keep the boxes someone commented that they would love to see my collection back there I will definitely um, take you guys on a tour of back there I don't do vendors <laughs> sales I stock up for myself or gifts you guys know that okay this is kind of hard to take out I don't like the styrofoam Oh, dear lordy. Okay, um. Oh my gosh. And I don't like these styrofoams because they're like, they make a mess. Okay, I'm just. Okay, here we go. Oh. 
Here we go. I like those paper crates better. All right. To be honest, this is mine, so I don't, I don't care if it kind of breaks. Cause I, I, when they're my box and it comes with the styrofoam, unless it's like, um, like the porcelain breakable ones, I just throw them out. My, um, my home decor is island, modern, farmhouse, chic. I don't know. Uh, I want to say. Um, I don't like being careful with things that need, that needs to be taken care of. <laughs> I have four kids. So I like things that are like, um, breakable. So if the kids break it, I don't have to worry. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. So this is the, the lid. And it's tin. Oh, it's it's glass lid on the inside. So I'm gonna put that down. And it is it does have um, sharp edges. So be careful. The light bulb is inside. Light bulbs are usually just wrapped like that. Okay, it's tin, guys. It's tin. I love it. Okay, so this is first. It's a black cord with a toggle switch. And here's the back. It has the Sensi logo, and it is tin. And I love how they made the the bottom like rustic brown, like the edges, as if it's you know, because when metal is out outside, rain, weather, it gets rusted. So I love how it's not perfectly shiny. That's those are the things that I love about my home decor. Is I like things to be rustic, um, kind of worn. And this definitely has the feel of warm, uh, not warm, worn, worn. You guys know I cannot pronounce. All right. Um, this is like the side roof and it has um, like the ripple, ripple effect. And then again, it's brown, like uh, um, rust around. It has the window. This is the barn door at the front. That's the back. Let me let me open up the lid. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so cute. I am going to be definitely displaying this downstairs. Okay, I'm already gonna put the light bulb. And it's a 20 watt. Always make sure that you use the right um, bulb size for the, the warmer. And always use our Sensi bulb. It does make a difference. Okay, so here is the okay country living is what it's called. It has a square dish. It says Sensi recommends four um, cubes, no more than four. Four is like the max. And you guys know me. I'm very stingy with my cubes. I just always always use ones once in a while. I'll use two. And, and then here's the roof. It has all those holes on there. It has that little chimney thing. Again, it's ripple. It's very, it looks very authentic. It, it looks very well made. You put the, I wonder if you can kind of reverse it. All right, so that seems to fit okay. Let me, I don't know if it's. I think you can use both ways all right so it looks like you can either put it at the front or the back but look how cute that is so the light bulb is inside the, these are like the windows and it's just um, see-through so that when the light is on it just kind of glows okay I will definitely turn that on and show you guys I love it I love it it's very rustic um, farmhouse look okay so the next one i have is called the mosaic mist okay this one that farmhouse i believe was 40 i can definitely take a look so i always use the bundles and save um i purchased that country living with three bars so here are one of the first three bars that i'm gonna grab and so i have tropic tango tropic tango is Tropical. I believe it has mango. I'll take a look what it has. All right. 
Tropic Tango has tangelo zest, mango puree, and coconut milk. You can definitely smell the mango puree. It's a nice, um, like a orangey color. And I always like to smell the bottom of um, where the cubes are. You can see the cubes. Because I feel like when it sits a while, that's where all the scent is, is at the bottom. And it's a bit more stronger than just smelling it at the top. I cannot wait to warm this. I definitely want to order more. You can really smell the, the hint of coconut with the mango puree. And it smells like a mango... Um, like a mango smoothie, okay? And then it uh, also has that tangelo zest, a hint of the, the like the orange zest to it. So that really is um, a nice new tropical scent because as you guys know with this new scent, my love Kahiko Hula did not make it. It took me a while to really get over that because Kahiko Hula is my number one scent. I took it for granted. I thought that it would come back and now it's gone. So come bring back my bar vote. I will spend my whole entire vote on just Kahiko Hula. So if you guys love me, please also vote for Kahiko Hula. Please vote. Kahiko Hula. Okay. I have some, but I don't have a stockpile. And I'm worried about that. Okay. The next scent, um, brand new scent is Churro. Churro. Um, churro. These are the brand new release scent. Um, churro churro is baked pastry sprinkled with cinnamon sugar captures that heavenly churro uh, charm. Like I said, I did smell this. It's a nice, like a beige um, bar. And then also the wax is nice and beige. It looks almost like um, vanilla buttercream. And it smells like churro. They get it all the time. All right. So I'm going to put it upside down. It. sorry I burped not ladylike but I just had lunch it smells like churro it smells like you know what this reminds me when we used to live in California back in Redondo Beach we would always walk the pier and before walking the pier I would always get one of those churros from that one famous stand it's been there for like decades oh my gosh it smells like churro 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 smells like churro the next one I got was Farms, um, Farmer's Market. It's a nice green wax. I got this because one of my favorites from spring and summer that is in my Sensei Club is Rainforest Bungalow. I just love the, the smell of that just natural um, rainforest scent. So I was hoping that this one would be like that, like a, like a natural, like clean, clear scent. It says crunchy carrot and cucumber with a hint of rose will have you seeing and smelling green. Okay, but when I smelled it yesterday, I'm not disappointed with it. It's just that. What do you expect smelling like carrot and cucumber, right? I'm going to get another one as well. My first order is just to try out. It smells green. It smells like you're juicing greens. That's what it smells like because I have a juicer. So it smells like you're, you're putting a carrot into that juicer, cucumbers, you know, lettuce. It smells clean like you like a detox green drink. That's all it smells like. And there's nothing wrong with that. OK, so got that one. And then I'm going to go ahead and open up the mosaic mist. Um, again, I also got three bars of that one. But let me go ahead and show you guys. This one is going to be a 25 watt, which is good because I bought these light bulbs that are 25 watts. So these light bulbs are just for the, the 25 watt warmer. So definitely cannot wait to, um, to try them out. I know I'm opening that, but I just wanna know what these are. Orange, I got an orange. I have a yellow. I have red I did get one of every color and then I have green okay so I have so I have that light bulb that I cannot wait to try with this one because this one mosaic mist is a multicolored and it has um oh okay let me 
the box was still heavy so i think it has always make sure that when you are unboxing that you are feeling for stuff because it could be like underneath the styrofoam which i think is um this this case i'm gonna break my nail okay so it is i think it's the dish that's at the bottom and then like i said i don't like the styrofoam because look i already broke it i hate i hate the styrofoam i like those paper crates better okay and plus styrofoams are not um eco friendly right all right so it comes with the light bulb and then um surprisingly the light bulb is it's in a box never had that in a box before when it comes with the warmer oh wow okay 25 watt bulb and these are mine so i open anything that's mine i do open and then it has a whole bunch of these like toxic gel things so there's like three of them okay black cord and it's gonna be so pretty i think it's gonna go really well with a like a spring and summer because my warmers are part of my home decor that's why i purchased them um when i open them up they are mine and sometimes i do showcase them to you but i don't use it and that's because i'm gifting them and then i tell you guys if you're one of them that received it i say i'm sorry i just opened it to showcase but black cord, black toggle switch. And then again, this one is just like the warmer of the month. The one that we have of the mermaid glass. It's one of those things that has a notch. You just got to make sure that your cord um, goes underneath. To tell you the truth, these are not my favorite because the cords are very stiff. It's not like it's a very like pliable cord. I feel like they're very stiff. And look at now how you have to bend it. I just wish that, you know, they went ahead and just sealed that because there are some warmers that they do seal it like that and then it just comes out. So in this case, it is. And then I'm just not too happy with it because it, it's it's really a stiff cord. It, it is glass mosaic and then the, um, the cement base that they use to, you know, to put the glass together is like a grade like um you know when you're tiling gray grout is that what it's called the grout um compared to like the white one with the mermaid glass i have that one downstairs so i'm gonna go ahead and put that light bulb in there because i'm going to showcase it to you guys when i um, display it into my home i'm gonna change out some warmers and then also it comes with the it comes with that white light bulb let me just show you guys how pretty it is. Mosaic mist. Is that what it's called? Mosaic mist. Yep, mosaic mist. It's um it has an ombre effect, so it's more yellow on the top. Then it goes to soft green, and then it goes to soft blue, and then blue, and then like a deep blue at the bottom. It's like a disco ball, but with colors. Okay? It's fairly heavy, it's well made, it's not light, it's not plastic, it is glass. And it seems like the base itself is just that heavy glass and then they use, um, whether it's glass or just one of those like little plastic things to put inside, um, not inside but the, the colors to put into the, what do you call that, the, the grout to have that mosaic effect, but the, the warmer itself is glass. I love the ombre effect, as you guys can see by the light. It goes from light to darker, okay? And, oh, let me show you guys the, the dish. So the dish was underneath the first pop-up. So the dish was underneath the bottom um, styrofoam. It's a pretty heavy dish, I can feel the the weight of it very heavy dish um it's a nice solid it says four recommend four cubes look at that okay here's the dish and then what i'm going to do is okay it has yellow so i have i have orange i have yellow 
And then I have green. What do you guys think I should put in here? And red. I don't think red. But definitely, I think you can use a, a green uh, bulb in here. And these were, I don't know how much they were. $2 or $1.75 or $3. Somewhere in there. They were very affordable um, for these ones. Um, there's also orange and then there's yellow. I think maybe a yellow would really look nice. But I'm going to show you guys... Um, the clear one as well as one of those colored ones okay so that's what that one is and then again I purchased the um, I purchased the bundle and save for that one all right before I show you guys the other ones I do have to put this back because I have OCD issues okay because the other one is like really messy and I don't want it to be messy as well with this one there are so many things on the spring and summer catalog that I really want. But I have until August. August to purchase. But slowly, slowly purchasing them. I love I love both of these warmers. I think they will really work well. Um, the, the mosaic mist will go really well with my um, warmer of the month that we have this month. And it's still 10% off. It's called the Mermaid Glass. I'll also, um, I'll also show you guys that one when I go downstairs. So another... Another three bars that I have is, um, one is Accidentally in Love. This is not a brand new one. We had this last year. This was one of my favorite as well. So I went ahead and ordered um, one. I love this. It brings a smile on my face. Family loves this. It's just sweet. It smells like, um, oh God, what does it, what does it smell like? I want to say that it smelled like the Hawaiian Punch but it's somewhat like that what is this i want to tell you guys what it is so that i can because i really love it i wanted to really stock up on that one it's not put into my sensei club but my sensei club only comes in like um once every other month so I, I don't really stockpile it i just make sure that i keep having it accidentally in love is a crisp gingery tangerine i can't really smell the ginger at all can smell the tangerine an exotic palm frond keep things clean and bright whatever the palm frond is makes it really really smell good smell fruity it's a perfect fruity scent okay love that that was one of my favorites last spring i'm so glad that it is back again all right a new one is going to be the now and zen nice colored um wax now and zen is sunny grapefruit balances calming chamomile in a yin and yang kind of love story Okay, and it is, it's very nice. It's very refreshing and calm scent. Um, has a bit of a fruit in there. Very light though. I like it. I like it a lot. And I'm going to get more of this one. I, I really like this one. Oh God, I really like this one. Okay. <laughs> I can actually use this as a cologne or a perfume. That's how good this one smells, okay? This is um, now and zen, okay? So that's, I don't recommend that, but I'm just saying. Uh, when we're desperate, kind of thing, you know, like we, we got to do what we got to do, right? So if you happen to have this in your purse or in your car and you're at the gym working out and you got to go somewhere on a hot date or something. <laughs> hey, it smells that good. Okay, I'm just joking with you guys. All right. I told you two hours of sleep and three cups of coffee. This is what you will get. All right, the other one, I heard this is a very popular new scent. Um, this one is called Prickly, Prickly Pear and Agave. And Prickly Pear and Agave, I was surprised to see that it was in a pink, um, uh, pink case and then green wax. Yeah. Sorry, I dropped that. Okay, uh, a pink, shell not case a pink shell and then a green wax prickly pear and agave is prickly pear and agave are sweet as a dessert mm, not dessert desert i told you i can't pronounce okay prickly pear and agave are sweet as a desert sunset behind a dreamy veil of sheer petals petals like flower petals it does smell good it is one of our popular um new scents I got a list of like the popular new scents. This was one of them, okay, that customers and um, consultants have been ordering. And it's only like what? I think today's the 8th, maybe the 9th, 10th, maybe 11th. 
<laughs> it is Wednesday. I don't even know the day of the week. I know the day of the week. I don't know the date. It smells good. It smells nice. Um, I like it. It's it's in the same category with me with now and then. Refreshing, calming. Nothing that's really overpowering. No, no flower. No overpowering flower or spices at all or or anything it's just it's just in the same category as now and then it's a great spa uh spa scent so that feeling of like feeling refresh definitely gonna get more of this one yeah yeah i like that one too okay Whew. all right so now um, my last warmer that i'm gonna show you guys i have this over here i'm actually gonna if you don't mind i'm gonna grab it All right, like I said, I use my warmer as part of my home decor. In my office, I wanted it to have like um, this right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. I don't know, it's just, honestly, I just took stuff around the house and then I placed it here. I didn't buy anything for this particular corner but that shelf and that shelf I got at um, Ikea. So this is how I love my, my um, home decor. And this is the, the new warmer that I got, the Southern Hospitality. It now comes as a mini warmer, a mini warmer. We call it mini warmer, but you can also call it like a wall plug-in because you actually plug it into a wall, but it's also called a mini wall, um, warmer because you can buy the tabletop base and then have a smaller version of this um, right next to it. Um, this one is the Southern Hospitality regular size. I believe this is 35. Um, and then that one is going to be 20. All right. Okay, I just wanted to show you guys the, the mama version of this one. So this one that I got is the mini warmer. Again, I used the bundle and save. You get the mini warmer and then you get three bars with it. I always do bundles and save if I can because then I can test out a warmer and then I can test out the bars as well. Okay, our mini warmers are, I believe, 15 watt. Okay, 15 watt. It always comes with a silicone. I think these are silicone washers. And see, these are like the crates, the paper crates that I like compared to those styrofoam. It comes with a light bulb all tucked in here. It comes with a base. This is the base that you use for the wall. And the nice thing about this one is that it plugs into your wall, okay, into your wall socket. Here's a here's a button right here to where you can turn it. So in case that your wall socket is upside down like that to where the prong, the third prong is on the top, then that's okay because then it turns so that you can still have your, your thing upright, okay? Or if it's sideways, that's fine as well because then you can turn it and it will still be upright. And then here is the off and on, okay? And then this is the mini. Oh, it's so cute. It's so cute. <laughs> I get excited. I do, I get excited over my, my Sensi purchases, okay? Oh my gosh, look at that. Okay, so it's gonna go like this. I'm excited. I'm not gonna put the light bulb. I'm just gonna show you guys, there's these notches on the edge, one here, one here, and then there's those notches in there. So you basically align them, okay? And then you turn, okay? See how it's it's secured right now? But it's gonna go like this. So I'm the socket, so it's gonna go like that. So this is what you see at the front. Isn't that cute? And then over here is where you put um, just one. I won't put, um, I. I don't ever put more than one. One cube is enough here. Maybe two, but I don't put um, more than one. You can put this in, you know, um, if you have pets, I don't recommend putting this into your wall socket that's low to the ground. Um, this is nice for kitchen um, or um, bathrooms too, so that the kids doesn't reach it. When the kids, when kids or dogs kind of touch this, they're not gonna get burned because our wax never gets too hot to where you get burned, but you can feel a little warmness onto the thing. Um, and then also it spills and you don't want spilled wax, you really don't. You can clean it up, but still, we don't want that. <laughs> Try to avoid that. So um, use the plugins where kids cannot reach it, pets cannot reach it as well. 
Okay, but this is Southern Hospitality. This is $20. Like I said, I purchased this with the bundles and save. And then the, the three bars that I got with it. Um, sea salt and avocado. Again, this is one of our popular scent. It's not a brand new one. It's an overall good scent. It's just clear, like, again, another spa. I call this a spa uh, scent because it's clean, it's refreshing, it's just perfect anywhere. Anywhere, bathroom, kitchen, bedroom, office. It's just an overall, all over scent. And it's a great performer as well, okay? The other one, I'm super excited. This is the one that I was super excited because I love cantaloupe. I love the smell of cantaloupe and honeydew. I'm a melon kind of girl, okay? So when the, this came out, do we and don't, do we and don't we? I was super excited. I'm like, I'm definitely going to love that. And that one says that it's a, we definitely do, D-E-W, just crushed basil over ripe cantaloupe is a gift from the garden gods. So it's supposed to be basil and cantaloupe. To be honest, I cannot smell basil because basil kind of has a strong, is it pungent sound? I mean, pungent smell <laughs> with basil. Not that, I don't know what pungent really means. Pungent to me means strong. So to me, basil has a bit of that strong scent to it. I really like basil. I have basil in my windowsill throughout the, um, the spring and summer. I cut it. Um, when I kind of trim it, I leave it there. Kind of brings out the, a nice smell into the kitchen. I cannot smell basil into this scent. Ooh, can you guys still see me? Okay, I just smell cantaloupe. It's, um, it's not an overpowering cantaloupe either. It's just a perfect cantaloupe. It's like a cantaloupe smoothie or a cantaloupe over ice. When you go get your boba tea and you're getting cantaloupe, that's what it smells like. Again, I like to do it upside down. It's a nice like peachy. It looks like a cantaloupe, to be honest. Like when you, when you cut a, a ripe cantaloupe, this is what it looks like. It smells like cantaloupe. It smells like, I love spring and summer catalog. Ah, you can just, oh, I know I'm putting it like all over my nose and it's fine. I love it. I love it. So I really am super happy with these new scents that I ordered. Um, we don't have a lot of the new release scents. I'm just going to go over them really quick with you guys. Um, we have B, My Honey, which is pineapple ring, sweet honey, and jasmine blossom. Then we have churro churro, which I like. It's It really smells like churro churro. The Be My Honey, I didn't order that because it smells like honey. Uh, it smells like straight up honey. And I'm like, okay, not my thing, but I will probably order one. Um, do we or don't we? That's the one. Farmer's Market, that's the one I have. I do like those three. Now and Zen, I like that as well. Another one is Pink Cotton. Find your fantasy on a cloud of clean cotton. Swirled with fruity pink berries and vanilla sugar. Maybe I'll order that. Prickly pear, I do like that. Strawberry taffy. Nostalgic notes of vanilla taffy folded with strawberry puree. Beckon straight from the memory lane. I think it, it was too fake strawberry, like a taffy. It just smells like that from the tester. Tropic Tango, I really like. That was the Tangelo Zest, Mango Puree and Coconut Wave. And then the other one that I don't mind ordering is um, the last new one, which is... Uh, Waves and Wonders, it is Dewy Beach Grass um, with Coastal Cypress. will have you feeling the amber sand between your toes, okay? So one more, I think one more, I needed one more. Um, lemon Sorbet is one of my go-to spray. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm so excited. I love it. It just smells like lemon, and I even took one already. Yesterday, I, I melted one here. That's what's melting right now into my office when I opened it yesterday because I was just ready for it. Um, I didn't want to open up the new ones, but it smells good. It just, it makes it, um, my office yesterday, really, because it was, you know, brand new. It's It made it smell like, um, gosh, there's that candy. I don't want to say it's Starburst. Maybe Starburst. One of those like candy chewy, just like Starburst, but I don't know if it's Starburst. It's, it just smells good. It smells good. It's nice and lemony, but because of that sorbet, let me read it to you what it is. Um, it's not a straight up lemon um, to me. 
Lemon sorbet is fresh cut lemon and grapefruit zest sweetened by sugar cane. Okay, so it's sweetened sugar along with that sugar cane. It's just a perfect lemon sorbet smell. All right, friends, um, I'm going to go ahead and end this now. I'm going to go downstairs and plug in these warmers and tell, um, show you guys how it looks. It is a pretty long video, but you know it's a haul, and you guys know how much I love my Sensi. So if ever you want to order um, Sensi, just go into my um, Sensi website, A Simply Simple Scent. I always link a, um, a party underneath the videos. Um, just copy that link. Um, it's usually on the um, online Sensi um, orders. Um, but you can just uh, attach it to one of the orders there and I'll be happy to um, to answer your questions if you have any questions regarding Sensi. Okay, as always, mahalo and thank you guys for visiting me. I do have a couple more videos that I want to make. One of them, I'm going to reach out. I have a new baby. She's a girl. <laughs> so I've had this for a few, maybe two or three months. Um, it's the Speedy 35. I kind of want to show you guys how it is inside, but I want to order that organizer first. So once I order that organizer, I'm going to show you guys how I like that. I really like it. I didn't think I was going to like it, but I really, really do like that Speedy. Of course, I have um, two videos in here that I just uploaded of recipes. Lola's uh, Shrimp Lumpia. So easy to make. Everybody loves that. I bring that to parties. Uh, it's just a go-to. It's a, it's a great go-to um, uh, finger food, finger appetizers. Instead of the, the regular uh, Filipino Lumpia, this one um, is a favorite as well. And then I just uploaded the cheesecake. Oh my gosh, that lemon cheesecake. Family's favorite. Sometimes I don't even put that meringue in there. I just put um, whipped cream. They're good to go. Those, um, those whipped creams in the can kind of spray, good to go because it's so good. All right. As always, thank you guys for uh, visiting me over here at Simply Simple Life. Mahalo, mahalo, aloha, aloha, aloha. Sending you guys so much good vibes because we are done with the snow. Bye-bye. All right, this is the mosaic mist. Look how pretty it is. And this is just a regular bulb that is in here. Um, I think it's just the sun ray that's having that line. So, is that not pretty? See, different angles will give you a different uh, view of the, the warmer. Okay. It's our warmer of the month. It wasn't part of this um, haul, but it's currently available for the month of March, 10% off, along with our scent of the, the month. But this is called the Mermaid, I believe Mermaid Glass. Okay. It's the Country Living. Look at that. Again, like I said, my home decor is a lot of these, like tin, um, tin decor. Okay, all the windows, the, the light just shines through that. And then I have, there's the dish. Okay, Do that. Here is the mini warmer of Southern Hospitality. Okay, I love how it has those um, glows from the, the holes onto the wall. Cute. And then let me have the light on. Okay, and this is what it looks like with the light on. Okay. All right, here is a light bulb that is colored green onto there. So I went ahead and changed the light bulb. Okay, I kind of like the, the original color, I think. It's hard. <laughs> it's blue.